Hi everybody, now I love my Shadow Cloud Gaming PC. So see this, this old laptop here that's seven, might even be eight years old now. Can't play games to save its life. But because I subscribe to the Shadow Cloud Gaming PC service, I've got a um, the ability to play high-end uh, PC games on this old uh, hardware by streaming them over the internet. And it works incredibly well. Honestly, works works fantastic. The way they've got rid of the lag is fantastic. However... Oh, and the other thing is it's a proper full PC as well, you know, so, you know, we've got, yeah, it's a, it's a full, full laptop in the cloud. You know, what you're seeing here, that isn't, that isn't the desktop for this PC. This is a desktop for the Shadow Cloud PC that I'm actually playing, uh, streaming. So it works brilliantly. The catch, however, uh, which if you've got a Shadow Cloud PC, you'll know is that it's quite expensive and the memory is quite expensive as well. And you end up with a situation where say we look at my Steam library, where you have all these games, but you can't actually install them all <laughs> because you haven't got enough space because it's quite expensive to add hard drive space to your Shadow Cloud gaming PC. So you probably have games that, that you don't know playing and you've probably got um, like um, games on, um, on, on on Epic as well that, that, that you don't want to play and, and th or you, you don't want to download, you don't want to fill up your, your hard drive. That's the catch I get into. So I'm going to give you give you an idea that, that you might want to try. And that is GeForce Now. Now GeForce Now is a stream service, a game streaming service, um, in a similar vein to a Shadow Cloud gaming PC. But instead of having your own PC in the cloud that you install games for, it streams each game on a, a session per session basis. Also, it has a free version where you can play for an hour. So, for example, when you download and install the GeForce Now client on your Shadow Cloud Gaming PC or on your normal, you know, the normal uh, hard drive, your, your, your laptop when it's not streaming, when you want to play, say, something like DayZ, it creates uh, an individual session for that on a server in the cloud and then you play it. And, uh, and basically, um, when you stop playing, it shuts that down. So there's no, like, desktop for you go to. You, you're playing each game on a case-by-case -case basis. Now, not every single Steam game is on here. Not every single Epic game is on here. But what you can do is you can go into the, you know, you go into the search thing and you could put like, I don't know, Cyberpunk, for example. And then you'd look at Cyberpunk and you'd see that the good old games version, the Epic Game Store version and the Steam version are compatible. So you would click on one of those. If you bought that game on one of those uh, services, uh, link up your account and then you can play and then it brings down your save settings and your progress from the cloud as you're playing it not everything's on there so for example if i if i wanted like battlefield 2042 if we look at battlefield there's only battlefield one on there as well uh, you know so there's swings and roundabouts but the really good thing is it's free <laughs> let me say it again it's free to play it for now you can pay them more money to have longer sessions and have a better quality um, and it will work with lots of your existing games that you've bought already in Steam and Good Old Games and, and I, feel, I, think, I think a few other s services as well. Let me have a look. Division. I'm sure. Yeah, Ubisoft. So, yeah, so, so they work with, with some Ubisoft games as well. Um, and it means that you don't have to tie up your hard drive space on your um, uh, Shadow Cloud Gaming PC with installs of games you might only play want to play for a little bit. You know, you might want to play them like for a few hours every month or something like that. And as I say, you can install it either on your Shadow Cloud Gaming PC or on the bit of your P the normal bit of your PC when it's done in the Shadow Cloud Gaming PC mode when you're streaming. But it works well, it works very good on both. Um, and as it's free, um, I think it's it's definitely definitely an option. It's and it's a it's a method I use for playing the games. You know, I've got all these games um, that I bothered to import. I mean, I have more games on Epic and 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 and, and all the Steam ones are here actually. But you know, you know, I'm not going to install all the. If I can't install all of these on my um, Shadow Cloud gaming PC, I just haven't got enough space. But with GeForce Now, when I want to play them, I can play Watch Dogs Two. I can play Metro. I can play any of these. Now, so check it out. It's free. Give it a go. See see what you think. 
Also, I always want to mention, I like to mention the Epic Game Store. Every week you should go to the Epic Game Store and you should check on their free games because they've got Dead by Daylight and there's While You Learn, Prison Market, I think, is next week. So always, always, always go to Epic Game Store, see what's free, create an account that's free, and then you know you can download the Epic Launcher and install them directly onto your Shadow Glane PC, or you can import them when they're compatible with them. Um, uh, with GeForce Now, in fact, lots of these games, Aftermath, that was free, Black Desert was free, Tacoma, Into the Beach, Watch Dogs 2, they were all free, Blair Weech, Metro, that was all free, Jurassic World, Control, Frostpunk, Surviving Mars, were done, um, Hunter, uh, Mudrunner, uh, Elite Dangerous was free, um, so Hitman was free, um, loads of them loads of you get so many free well every every week there's normally a free game and although might have quite a lot of them are kind of indie ones that you might not be interested in you do get the odd triple a title so there we go there's a solution for the problem of your shadow pc not having enough memory not having enough hard drive to install the game so you don't end up playing them consider supplementing it with the free version of geforce now anyway that's enough for me hope you found that useful if you have hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe and i will see you again soon